after her will always be better than mine, so I'll just leave it at that. <laughs> uh, but, but first off, just can you walk me through the home run, what you were looking for, what you saw, and how it felt to be able to hit 100 miles an hour off the ground? Um, honestly, I went in my first at bat uh, going in to take the first pitch because I was just like, oh, okay, we're facing the ground. I was excited to face the ground today. Honestly, what I couldn't have been more excited to face any other pitch in the league. Uh, definitely has my respect, but um, I went in there and a lot of people were saying like it's an angry 100, it's, it gets on you. And after I took the first pitch, I was just like, oh, it, it, it didn't really get on me like I was expecting how everybody else said. And then I got a, a one fastball and I was early. So after I was early, I was just thinking that he was thinking the same way I was thinking like, OK, he's early on my fastball. So since he's so far out front, I'm going to throw off speed now. So I was looking for an off speed pitch and he threw me a fastball up and I just reacted to it. Got my hands above the ball. And yeah, it was a homer. And then secondly, what do you think this win can do for you guys? You talked about how you guys were frustrated because you felt like you were playing better than your record. What can a win like this, doing what you guys did against the Grom and, and the Mets in general, do for you guys as you try to move forward? Um, I feel like a win like this uh, will get us going, you know, that it's DeGrom on the mound, especially, you know, we always in the past have hit DeGrom really well. I'm saying we like I was there, but um, uh, yeah, they've always, we've always hit DeGrom really well. And I feel like he was always the guy that got us starting. You know, he always got our motor started every year. So I feel like this is the time for him to get our motor started again. Let's go to Danny Alvarez. Thank you, Jason. Uh, Jazz, you, you said that it didn't look like 100 to you, that, that pitch from, from the ground. Is that because of the level, level of confidence that you have right now? I mean, honestly, it's, it's, some, it's a heavy, it's heavy 100 and it's a lighter 100. And I felt like his 100 was on the lighter side than the heavy, the heavy ball throwers. You know, like some, some people's 100 are very heavy. So like, it feels like it's harder and some people's are heavier. Uh, some people's 100 is a little bit lighter. So to me, I felt like he was on the lighter side on like Jordan Hicks is more of a heavy 100, you know. And secondly, uh, how did Trevor look to you out there? In the oh, man, I'm excited for Trevor. I'm very excited. He showed emotion to me, at least. This is my first time ever seeing him show emotion on or off the field. So I'm excited to see where he goes after today and getting out of the spots that he got out of today. I mean, he was electric out there. It looked like he was throwing an invisible out there. Greg Mish. Hey, Jazz. What were you thinking as you were rounding the bases after hitting that home run off uh, DeGrom? Honestly, you just round the bases. <laughs> I wasn't thinking anything crazy. I wasn't like, okay, like I just hit a homer off DeGrom. That's cool. But I got to go try and do it again, you know? Like, it wasn't really of a, oh, yeah, I just hit a home run off of the Grom. You know, I feel like my abilities allow me to, should allow me to hit a home run off of anybody. My hands should be able to get to any ball that I can swing at, you know? But, I mean, I just felt like it was another pitcher out there. But, obviously, it was the best pitcher in baseball today. But, you know, I felt like I, I was supposed to do that. Thanks. Peter? Hey, Jazz. Did you know that was gone immediately? Uh, yes, off the bat. Off the bat. As soon as I hit it, I, I knew it was out of there. There was no holding that ball back. All right, Jeff. Thank you. And I'm late for the bus. I'm not making you it. You got it. No, no, you got it. Let's go. You oh, got I got it. it? For real? Let's go. Thank you, guys.